October 2, we're talking about Christian Pharisees in today's daily devotionals in the Inspired by God YouTube channel. Please subscribe if you guys are blessed by this. My name is Tilla. You guys can follow me on all social media if you guys want to. Um, again, it is October 2, October, October 2nd. And the question of the day is, how can I adopt a Christian lifestyle without appearing judgmental or legalistic? We are again... Reading from Pastor Doug Bachelor's 365 Amazing Answers to Big Bible Questions. Here we go. These people draw near to me and with their mouth and honor me with their lips, but their hearts is far from me. Matthew 15 and verse 8. What makes a person pharisaical, pharisaical or legalistic is a lack of genuine love for God. Everything we do should be with one thought in mind to express love and esteem for Jesus, First uh, John 3 and verse 22. When Christ is honored and reflected to others, they will be drawn to him. Our question should always be, will, will this honor Jesus? Would I listen to this, sing this, do this, watch this, drink this, buy this, read this, say this, or go there if Jesus were here in person with me? Jesus is with us, Matthew 28 and verse 20, and his angels see everything we do. We must sense Jesus' presence in every facet and activity of life. When we con uh, consciously spend time with him, we become like him, 2 Corinthians 3 and verse 18. Then when people are with us, they will respond as they did to the disciples of old. They marveled and they realized that they had been with Jesus in Acts 4 and verse 13. Christians who live like, like that will never become pharisaical, judgmental, or uh, legalistic. In Old Testament days, God's people were in almost constant apostasy because they choose to live as their heathen neighbors rather than follow the, the distinctive lifestyle God, God outlined for them, Deuteronomy 31, verse 16, and Judges uh, 2, verse 17, and 1 Chronicles 5, verse 25. It is still true today. No one can serve two masters. Those who cling to the world's uh, lifestyle, or no, those who cling to the world's lifestyle will be slowly molded by Satan to adopt his feelings and desires and thus be programmed to be lost. Those who follow Jesus' principles will be changed into his image and will be prepared for heaven. There is no middle ground. Jesus said, He who does not take his cross and follow after me is not worthy of me. Matthew 10 and verse 38. Following the Lord requires, requires sacrifice, but what we sacrifice is microscopic compared to what we gain. The God of the universe wants to adopt us as his children and to love us forever. He wants to give us everything. That's what we have for today, October 2, in today's daily devotionals. If you guys were blessed by this, please like and share. And also, please make sure to subscribe and also hit, hit the bell uh, so that you guys can get notified every time we upload new videos. And for those of you guys who want to support this ministry, you guys can do so by praying for this online video ministry and also donating at schoolforprofits.tv. We will take the donations. We will use them for more Bible study films and videos and also to reach more people out there. And for those of you guys who want to make big donations, please don't forget to let me know. My email is in the description box. Email me if you want to make big donations so that I can give you guys a big gift. So thank you guys again. Praise God always. And I'll see you guys at the Discord if you guys want to join us there. Link is in the description box. Peace.